Hello, it's Olimik. In today's video, we're going to be reviewing and testing CG Solid OBD scanner and see if it will be useful for you or not before purchasing one. Before opening the package, they mention all the features that this OBD scanner is capable of and we're going to try them one by one. So let's go ahead and open the package and see what we got. So here is the OBD scanner itself. The main body is hard plastic, no rubber grip, no battery required, which is a good thing, and a decent length wire. It comes with a useful manual if you want to learn using all the features for this OBD scanner and a warranty card. You can fill this up and send them to get one year of warranty. They also provide you a USB cable for a lifetime free update and printing data that you previously saved it in the CG Solid storage. But you need to install the CG Solid software first on your computer. The buttons are rubber which is a good thing when your hands are dirty and there is three light indicators for IM readiness emission test. Green indicates that the engine is ok and working properly. Yellow, the tool finds problem. It will be in two possibilities which I will show you later. Red indicates that there is a problem or more than one with the system and it will not pass emission test. The buttons are easy for understanding. Here's back, here's ok, here's reset and here's the info. And the arrows for up and down and left and right and the middle one is the emission test. Alright, let's go ahead and test it on a Camry first. The OBD scanner port located under the steering wheel. Once we plug it in, it will power up the CG Solid OBD scanner. We're gonna put the key on ignition position so it can communicate with CG Solid OBD scanner. First of all, I'm gonna go to setting and turn off the beeping sound so you don't have to hear it continuously. There is also options for changing units from metric to English and changing language as well. From about tab, you can know the serial number, when it's made and all this stuff. Here you can save the data and print it later with the software on a computer. Here you can watch saved data, DTC lookup. Here you can search a specific code and know what it means. For example, let's try. That was wrong. Let's try something else. So if you didn't have internet access and wanted to search for a specific code, this will be helpful for you because all the codes are saved in this device. Okay, let's go to OBD tab and try one of the features that this device provide which is live data. It will take some time to list all the sensors that this car has for reading data. Watching these live data are important when you have error code with the sensor and you want to know when it will miss reading with the graph. Let's try catalytic temperature. The temperature is rising and reading it so it's live data. Another feature this device provides is onboard monitoring. If you press it, it will list all the cars. So let's choose Toyota and if you go to misfire, you can choose individual sender as well. It will show the number of misfire. So no misfire so far. Let's try another feature which is emission test. Just press the middle button and it will check the car. We can see the yellow light is on. These are ready for reading. These are not ready. And these are not supported. If you remember that there are two possibilities when you have yellow indicator. If you have code. In my case, I don't have error code or engine light is on. So in the manual it says some of vehicles emission monitor not working properly when it shows no DTC but the yellow light is on so the monitor has not running. The most important feature of the OBD scanner is reading codes. We have this car here with the warning engine lights on. Let's read the code. Even if you're not fixing your car, you can read the codes and print the errors and take it to the dealer and tell them that you have these problems. That way you won't need them to test the car and pay extra each time you have a problem with your car. Red light indicator is on and it means we have some serious problem with the engine. It found two codes. We have a code at storage code. The code is PO341 which is the camshaft sensor. Let's go back and add the pending codes. Same code PO341 which is the camshaft sensor. So this car was shutting off the engine by itself in the middle of the road few times a day. We easily found the error code with the CG Solid OBD scanner. You just need to replace the camshaft sensor or take it to a mechanic and tell them to replace the sensor for you. So after fixing the problem, you can use CG Solid for erasing the codes. Let's say you fix the problem and change the sensor and want to erase the code. But the error code will come back again because we haven't replaced the sensor yet. All these are not supported with this car but the green light indicator is on so it will pass the emission test. But the engine error code will come back again because we haven't replaced the sensor yet. And the last important feature that I want to share with you is the ID number. You can know your car's ID number and compare it with the one on the plate to see if they match. 
This one is important when you're buying a used car and want to know if they replace the electronic control unit or the main ID plate on the body. I had this one before and needed to connect with my phone for reading and erasing the codes. But with the CG Solid, you will have more features than reading and erasing the codes. In my opinion, it's a good tool to have even if you're not fixing your car. The link will be in the video description box below. Use my discount code AliMake to get 12% off. So that's it for this video. Hope the video was helpful and learned something new. If it was, like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.